On Sunday, July the 28th, 2019, our beloved Supreme Master Ching Hai gave an impromptu lecture to our fortunate Kuan Yin fellow practitioners at the Hong Kong Center. After the recent unrest in the region, Master mentioned why she traveled to Hong Kong. Since I came to Hong Kong, I tried to spread a lot of love around where I live. And that will calm down your place a little bit. I'm trying to, to do my best uh, for the rest of my time on this planet. And all of you also, okay, do your best. Uh, meditate as much as you can, because there's nothing else better to do with your precious time as a human on the planet, okay, huh? And also help each other, please, help each other. Not only the person receives the benefit of your love, but you yourself also benefit from it. Anytime you help someone else, any other beings also, unconditionally, you rise up, your soul rise up, and your noble quality rise up, your love expand. Any love, unconditional love, is always beneficial to you, to your family and to the world, huh? I like to stay as long as possible just to help more, help the world, especially to stop the killing karma so that the world became peaceful, loving place for everyone to stay. Master then briefly spoke about what the world will be like if peace and love prevail. If we make this world a vegan and peace world, then the beings born in the next generation will be higher level of consciousness and they will have less problems. Yes, where we have higher tech. We could even create superhuman gene, superhuman DNA. Then we will not possibly be sick ever again or we we'll live a very long life. For that goal we are working right now, I'm working for that. Actually, we can. We can do all that. Only if the atmosphere of the world are peaceful, natural, and uh, benevolent. After one of our association members explained her struggle to step outside of her home due to feeling uncomfortable, Master gave an example of her recent experience in Hong Kong, sharing her pure, unconditional love and happiness with hotel staff, taxi drivers, and even women escorts, reminiscent of Lord Jesus' compassionate manner towards ostracized women. The other day I had to go and change some money. Yeah, I went with one of your brothers. I don't know anything about Hong Kong. And so we went and changed money. I had to pass through some nightclub. And there was some girl, three, three, four girls sitting in front of that nightclub door, you know. And you know the way they wear, you know, <laughs> you know who they are. And there's a mama son also sit together with them. Master asked them for directions to the money exchange place, and the mama san, or the lady in charge of the women escorts, told her the way. On the way back, Master lovingly offered them some food. And then I say, I'm going to eat some Indian food now. Would you like some? And the mama san said, No, 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 no. You don't bother, you don't have to bother. I say, no, I like to, I like to give to the girls. All the girls say, yes, 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 <laughs> please, please. <laughs> this is how you spread love, okay, unconditionally. You don't have to buy things and give it to them like me, like that, but be friendly and loving to all, okay? I know who they are, okay? I know what they do, but I respect and love them just the same as I respect and love you. I have not one nano-centimeter of difference between them and you. So make sure you go out. If you have to go out, or you don't make excuse to go out if you don't want to, of course, but you go out when you have to. Live a normal life, okay? My heart is pure wherever I go. Yeah, I go to different places. If I have to go, I just go. And I go some places that are not 
you know, like a good girl style, like <laughs> good family, like uh, places. But I do go. I go make them happy. Yeah, make people feel that okay, at least their life is not all that hopeless and miserable. Somebody still love them and respect them as a human. In speaking of giving tips to hotel staff, taxi drivers or giving food to the women, Master explained the following. If I can afford it, you know, I give them tip, good tip, you see, so why not? Nah? I give tip not because of money, but to spread love, okay? In, in physical means, so that Hong Kong have more peace, more love. It's not the money that I give, it's the love and the peace through that gift. You understand? It's not the food that I bring to them, it is the love that I give also. Our eternal gratitude, beloved Master, for your loving strength, everlasting patience and constant fortitude to continue helping uplift all beings on our planet and beyond. Our world is a brighter, much better place because of you. We are forever grateful to all the heavenly beings and the mighty Godzess for safeguarding our most precious Master. For the full broadcast of this lecture by Supreme Master Ching Hai, please tune in to Between Master and Disciples at a later date.